Hey, everybody, it's the Michael Kaya Morning Show. Okay, all right, I'm trying to get it together over here, y'all. We're really trying to get it together. It's, let me tell you something. This is a rough one. We thought we were going to be able to just walk through this thing. But first of all, I'm stuck in the airport in Chicago. Look, I'm at O'Hara, which is good, though, because they got all their Christmas stuff. Hold up. You got to check out all their Christmas. They got all their Christmas ornaments and stuff up already. But I'm stuck here in all kind of ways. First of all, I don't have my credit cards with me, so they wouldn't give me a rental car. So I'm stuck right here waiting for my brother to come. Uh, secondly, we stuck on our comedian. Looked like that boy didn't show up. But we don't care. We so happy to be back. I don't know about the rest of my team, but I'll tell you something. I have missed not being here for a week, for almost more than a week. I mean, I, I miss it. This, this is my lifeblood right here. Good morning, family. What can I say? God woke us up on a beautiful day. He's generous, he's wonderful, he's kind and great. So let show our Father we appreciate. Hey, God is good. God is good. God is good. Ba 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 do ba ba. Hey, good morning, family. What can I say? God woke us up on a beautiful day. He's generous, he's wonderful, he's kind and great. So let show our Father we appreciate. Hey, God is good. God is good. God is good. Ba 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 do ba. God is good. Oh, God's good. God's good. Good morning, everybody. Roll call real quick. Debbie Howard, how you doing, babes? Uh, William Brown, can I get you an interview my artist? You can get me to interview your artist. All you do is go to my uh, Instagram, DM me your name, your artist name and number, and what they do. I contact you and get you, and that's easy to get on here. Right now, like I said, I'm in Chicago. Just got through doing five shows. In Buffalo, New York, one last night, two Friday, two Saturday, they were off the chain. They were amazing. I, you know, I want to put emphasis once every day for this week on things that happened at the wedding. You know, a lot of you folks knew about the wedding. You knew it was coming. Some of you mad because you didn't get invited. Some of you just, you're feeling hurt because you didn't invite. Don't be either one of those. Trust me, if you didn't get invited, it's only because we ran out of space. We were supposed to be like doing like 140 people. Before we looked up, we had 268 RSVPs. So we tried to whittle that down and make it work. You know what I'm saying? So we couldn't get everybody there. You can't dance at every wedding anyway. But we are here today to tell you about some of the highlights. And wait a minute. I got to go in my, I got some little couple of photo things I got to throw up before I bring my baby. Ooh, and I got to get my, I mean, everything. You ever one of them days? where everything that could possibly go wrong is going wrong. You know, I jump on a train to go uh, rent, to get there and find out they won't rent it to me because I don't have a card to with me. I said, I need to put the cash on it. Then now nah, without a card, you can't get it. The airport in Buffalo is entirely credit cards. You can't use no cash nowhere in the Buffalo airport. At the restaurant, the store, nowhere, no machine, you got to have a car, you know, soon they're not gonna need human beings no more. You know what I'm saying? They everything is so automated. You ain't shoot, man. You'll be the only person here pushing buttons and stuff. Anyway, it's a beautiful day. It's an awesome day. We had a wonderful time in Buffalo. The people of Buffalo showed me so much love. Big shout out to Helium, a fantastic, fantastic club. Uh, and let me look in here real quick because I do want to do one more. I do have to uh, who said blah, blah, blah? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. One of my best friends is on right now. He, it says Blackwood, but his name is Big Al. Talking about blah, blah, blah. That's my brother, man. Thank you for being on the show this morning. And I'm about to bring my queen on with me at the top of the show before we even get to our, um, our beautiful, gorgeous, funny, intelligent, awesome co-hostesses. Before we get to them, though. First thing we got to do, and y'all hit some likes. I don't see but three likes and 37 viewers. Mm, y'all play too much. That's your problem. See, I don't nobody mess with y'all. I'm going to pay you no attention because you don't know how to play the game. Anyway, good morning. Good morning, Big Al. Thank you for coming. Uh, I keep freezing. I'm sorry if I am. Let me bring my baby on. Uh, my sweetheart, my wife, my honey. I've been married, y'all, for nine days. I was married, y'all. And so let me get my wife on here. Okay, I said it a couple of times. So I guess I'm bringing her on myself. Okay, there she is. Hey. All right. Sweetheart, how you doing? Oh, oh baby. Good. 
you everything that can go wrong today is trying to go wrong, but I'm not going to let it daunt me, baby. Okay, first of That's all, right. I tried to go get a, a car, found out I couldn't. Had to get right back on the train, come back here, try to get here in time to start the show. Going to re reach in here, pull out my iPad so I could do it. Girl, I left the iPad on the plane. My main no. iPad is on the airplane. So Malika's calling over there now, trying to see uh, if I can go back to United and go to their uh, lost and found and just get that like an hour when I get through. Meanwhile, my brother Courtney, my favorite brother, woo, 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 is driving down with his Aww. wife to pick me up. Yay. And we're going to go somewhere fabulous and have one of the best breakfasts on the planet, you know, and everything will work itself out because it always does, it always you know. Is. Just like we're here right now. My girl Katie came in, set everything up for me because I was in these planes. She already talked to people, set them up, got them ready to go. And that's how come we could flow because my team, is off the chain. How you feeling, sweetheart? Oh, wonderful, baby. Missing you. Can't wait to kiss your face again. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I can't wait to kiss more than your face. But it's a family okay. show, and family I can't go no details like that right now. <laughs> I love you, sweetheart. How's it feel? You've been married nine days now, mama. How's it feel? I said, my God, it feels amazing. I love you. I love you too. Baby. I mean, I feel like I love you more every day. You know, when I'm when I'm on the phone and we're somewhere else and we're just looking at each other talking, my love for you just grows and grows. And I don't mean in a physical way. I mean spiritually. You know, like that. I don't mean it's a family show. Okay. Anyway, in Buffalo, out. we had so much fun. Yeah. I invited yeah. so many people to watch the show. I hope we have a bunch of new viewers who jumped on. Well, from Buffalo, who saw the show last night, if you are on here, jump on in there and let us recognize you. Paulette Walker. Let me just say Paulette Walker. I oh, love you. I love you, Paulette. Uh, oh, Nellie Bebe's on here, too. Uh, one, of the, one of the wedding highlights is uh, my minister wasn't able to make it, and we needed a prayer. And my baby just off the top of the middle of the ceremony just called up Paulette. And, and, mm -hmm. and um, Elder Paulette came up and put a prayer on us. It was so awesome. Wait, baby, I got to show a couple of pictures real quick. Don't you go nowhere. Um, this is the guy here who shot all the video and the film. And we're releasing a video in about 30 days, a one hour of the best wedding you've ever seen in your life. But Look the guy who did back all up, the baby. Film, it, it went away. I know, because I, I wanted to tell him who it is first. Oh, okay. Because I put it up, it blocks us out. Oh, okay. So I, I just wanted to tell him. So the guy on there, his name is Stephen Williams. Now, this is Stephen Williams, the world-renowned photographer. Not to be confused with Stephen Williams from 21 Jump Street, the actor, Stephen Williams, who Stephen was, S. Uh, what was, uh, uh, huh? Stephen yeah, S. Stephen S. Williams. S. Williams is the photographer. But oh, Stephen, Stephen S. Williams, yeah. this is Stephen S. Williams. Yeah, that's the photographer. Can you hear me, baby? Uh-huh. Mama, I can hear you. you I, hear I, I, okay, I wasn't yeah. sure. I wasn't sure people could hear when the film is up there, when the pictures up. Okay, okay yeah. so that's that's the guy who did all of him and his partner did all the photography. Now, one of our guests that was really wonderful was Stephen William, the actor. Mm -hmm. Um, y'all just have to bear with me a little bit because I'm not with my big screen in front of me, so I don't have. Um, uh, I can't see these little pictures really good. Katie, if if you're with me. I would love some help, baby. Uh, I'm looking for Stephen Williams, the actor Stephen Williams. I think I there found him. There he is. There, there it is. is. Thank you. <laughs> See, I know my girl was on it. See, that's Stephen Williams right there from 21 Jump Street. And also, now this is something y'all may or may not know. He was also the cop that was chasing uh, John Belushi. I mean, Jim Belushi. No, John Belushi and Dan Aykroyd in... Um, uh, uh, what was it called, y'all? Remember the movie? And and the cop chased them all. The Blues Brothers. Oh, Anybody out there remember the Blues Brothers? This was him <laughs> when he was in the Blues Brothers. Oh wow, he looks. Now that's that there. Stephen Williams, not to be confused with this Stephen Williams. Right. <laughs> he looks great there, and he's seventy-two years old right now. And he's still working more than anybody I know. So I want to thank him for coming. I don't want y'all to forget though that Christmas is right around yeah, the corner. Okay. I just show I just showed y'all all the decorations they got going on down here at the airport. So Christmas is coming. 
and uh, I'm ready for it. And one more thing, I just have to say, before we get started, I bring on everybody else, Mama. Uh, my great friend, I got a chance to talk to him and sing happy birthday to him yesterday, day before yeah. yesterday. Sinbad. <laughs> Sinbad is doing good, y'all. He actually talked to me. You know, he, he still have a little something going on in his voice, so I know he's still coming along. He's still coming along. But God bless him, and happy birthday to you, Sinbad, and happy, happy birthday, birthday to your family. We love you. I mean, let me tell you, I was so sharp at the wedding. Me and, and Rogers, Rogers, my yeah. road dog, y'all. Yes, That's he my is. dude. Wherever we go, him and his wife, the lovely Shindra, come and hang out with us. Hell, I thought it was his wedding. He got more props than I did during the whole wedding. He partied, you know. Um, and then look, Rosa May, the girls yes, got out there dance. Rosa That's Malira, Rosa May, and Rogers' and wife, Malira. Shindra. Now, this is the. <laughs> And mama, that's the nightclub we went to. That's the townhouse. Mm -hmm. And what nobody danced at first, and then my 82 year old aunt got up and got the dance. Yes, he did. And I'm everybody good. got to getting it on, you know. Yes, and this couple, Zeal and Trig, they both sang at the uh reception. And I mean they sang they face off. Zeal can sing. I didn't know her husband could. That yeah. boy's off the chain, too. But this is us when we looking good. Sometimes we get excited. It was a lot of bald headed people at the wedding. And um that that brunch. Us, we got a picture of mm -hmm. that that's was where at the, the brunch? At the brunch. That was yeah. at the brunch. And of course, that's that's the great Walter Miller who books the shows and Rogers yeah. and myself get the damn tongues back in. And but you know, but I you I was gonna come on looking like my regular self, you know, like this. But oh, I said y'all ain't ready for the <gasps> MC. So let me pull that down and get to the regular. Stuff. Baby, mm -hmm. was it the best wedding you've ever been to? And don't say it just because it was yours. <laughs> well, it was the best wedding I've ever been in. <laughs> oh, me, me too. It was so perfect. The most perfect part yeah. of it, y'all, it started on time. Let's salute yeah. Malika Blessing, who did a hell of a job pulling this whole thing yeah. together. She's not the only one. A lot of our friends helped. But she sort of really got it all lined up, coordinated. And I mean, at 3 o'clock, we started. We said it's at 3. At 3, we started, and we locked the church doors. That's Unfortunately, right. my beautiful, wonderful friend, Marla Gibbs, 92, was locked out the church. So was Bird, the judge, <laughs> uh, Ju Judge Judy Bailiff, and 42 other people was all locked out for the first 15 minutes because we yeah. started on time it was exquisite about 15 minutes in we opened the door so they can come get in before baby walked down the aisle and then you came down the hall down the aisle and all your grace and glory Aww, and beauty you, and made me the happiest man in the whole wide world i Aww, love you baby i love you too i love you too did you, now, um, you, you did you tell everybody you, yet no i don't think you have about what you have coming up for christmas just in time for christmas no, what do I have coming up? You talking about the, the TV show, the movies and stuff? No, child, we don't get to that later. Not on. that. Not I want to give a shit. What, baby? What's going on for Christmas? There's the so Christmas much stuff going book. on. Just in time for Oh, Christmas. the book is out right now. Oh, we're going to talk about you, right, baby? My new book is out. She's talking about Lil Bobby White, and it's ready. It'll make a wonderful Christmas gift. You want to do number? Go to Amazon, and okay. you go to Amazon, and you can buy it. It's only $15. Now, I it's can't see time. comments, so let me see if I'm yeah, if you can buy it for, it's a, it to is a, as I'm it talking. Is, it is a children's ahead, book, baby. and it'd be a great Christmas uh -huh. gift or even a great stocking stuffer for all your grandbabies. I have two grandbabies, and it's about a little boy who always chooses to do the right thing. And I love it not only because my honey about. wrote it, but it's it's because it's Come about on, us, you know, it's about um, it represents just doing the right thing and it, it represents us. You know, we always get a bad name for, you know, uh, kids, of, of course, kids of color not doing the right thing. But we, this book, you know, represents all kids, um, but definitely kids of color doing the right thing, all the, you know, choosing to do the right thing. So please go get your book, get it's your beautiful stuff book. or your gifts for your grandbabies and your kids. It's a, again, it's a great stocking stuffer. And I, I'll show a picture of the book tomorrow. It's really good. And I only have the soft back out right now. 
So you better uh-huh. get that because that ain't for fifteen dollars. I'm I'm about to get the hardback. We picking that up as soon as I get back to L. M. in Chicago right now to do a corporate gig for McDonald's. Yeah. But then I get a chance to come back home in a few days. Uh, we need to talk to, to McDonald's, baby. Every- we need to talk to McDonald's about getting it in their Happy Meals. I like that I idea, books- and you know we know who to talk to. Yes, they have Happy. They but have listen, folks, I want meals. to say. I want to say thank you to all the people who are on my show. Almost every regular on the show made it to the wedding. Straya yeah. and Katie made it to the wedding. Yeah. Uh, uh, Walter Miller yeah. was at the wedding. I mean, everybody who works the shows. The uh, only thing we missed, Dr. Lakeisha Legree. Yeah. She couldn't make it. We missed but besides Dr. that, uh, uh, Jackson, uh, uh, Sabrina Jackson. Yeah. You know, so anyway. Everybody showed up. It was awesome. And every day this week at the top of the show, we'll talk a little bit about it and we'll show you a little bit. I just want to see if my guy who's so awesome put up this one piece of tape we really need. Miss Elaine um, We saw Miss Elaine. Even, oh, Miss uh, Elaine was there. Oh, Lord, what's my boy? E-Baby Lee? did a poem oh. to shut it down. Huh? Said, E-Baby's oh, poem. Oh, my God. Oh E-Baby my God. got me all stirred up. I was doing good to E-Baby start saying the poem. Oh, it was beautiful. Mm. It was beautiful. It was, it was, so everything was, I mean, my boy, uh, jo- Josiah Jones. Oh, my God. Josiah was our ring man. Stuff. But we don't want to tell him everything. We don't want to tell him everything in one day. We want to tell y'all a little bit. And maybe we can find out what was the highlights of my girls, of Michael's angels. So let me bring on our co-hostesses with the most is it. Oh, great picture, Jack K. Go, but do that again with Jack K and Josiah. Jack K and Josiah. Josiah has so much fun. I'm running one day nothing but Josiah pictures. Yes. He took pictures with everybody, everybody, everybody. Okay, pull that down. So everybody on the team, Team Calliot was there. So it was really good. And this young lady here, she had, I mean, she must have had a hundred people, at least 60, that flew here from Winston-Salem. When I told people, everybody stand up from out of town. Two thirds of the people was from out of town. They flew, they bought airline tickets, got hotel rooms, had to get meals and came to honor us. And it was the most perfect wedding in yeah. the world. Baby, let's bring on you. our co-host, yeah. Katie Kate and Straya. Y'all come on my sidekick hey, and, and oh, there's Katie. Hey, Katie. Hey, Good hey, morning, Good morning. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. How y'all doing? We are good. I'm. I, 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 I want. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead, uh, Straya. No, I just was Straya. gonna say I'm just fantastic. I feel like I got married too. <laughs> you did. We all married. <laughs> It was yeah. so much love in the room. It was so crazy. I, do, you, do you have a highlight, Straya? I you do. Pick one I, highlight I, I know everything is always about you, but the highlight of the wedding was when Sonya walked down the aisle. I was crying real hard. Like I was so <laughs> happy for her. It was just, Thank it's just, you. it's so good to just love. I mean, I tell the rest the rest of the week, but I will start off with Sonya. Like when she was coming down the aisle, I was. I was crying, and then I saw Joy crying. I was like, "See, that's that Scorpio." <laughs> like, I mean, I know that's her daughter, but I was like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> Thank I'm you, baby. <clears throat> I, wow. I was a job too. <laughs> Katie, what's a highlight you was could think of right off the top? Well, where I was sitting, and everybody all pulling their phones out, recording like this man they have no cameraman, like it was some broke people with. <laughs> <laughs> so you couldn't really see Sonya that good from where I was sitting, like the, the what y'all gonna get to see. So I thought about it. I said, "What is Michael doing?" So I turned around to Michael, and Michael, <laughs> he looked like a little little bitty boy. And I looked at Michael, and y'all, Michael so ghetto. I look at this man, and he had just like everybody else. He was getting ready to cry. He took, pulled his phone out and started recording this lady walking down the aisle. I say, who does this? My I baby. Said, I, I had to video oh, that. Can you say I had the best point of view. Oh, when he turned around. I was at the altar. Oh, when he was at the altar and he turned around while the wedding is going on and say, 
I've never been to a wedding where the um the the groom turn around and say, "Damn, everybody look good." I'm sorry, I, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> like Yo, who does so ghetto. It was that's my that's my baby. I you know what. I know it, it's the, it's it's just different. He's different. That's what it is. Michael Cap. That's what I love about him. He captures anything that's happening. He's always in the moment, and that's what makes life so sweet. He. I mean, I'll, he'll do oh, me like that. All I the time. love you, baby. He'll do that. We'll be. I'll be in the house just doing anything. He'll be like, wait, 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 wait. I'm like, what? And he'll just pull all his phone and take a picture of it. And I'm hey, like, so that it did surprise but me. I mean. <laughs> Y'all, y'all know what Michael said. The um, yeah. they, they called Paulette up to pray, and the funny part about it is, is like he said, as soon as she called Paulette up to pray, <laughs> Paulette was like, "Okay," and it, 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 I thought it was part of. I thought, I thought that was planned. I thought no, she was supposed to we pray. Didn't tell her at all. She she <laughs> walked so up good. There. She walked up there like this was. Part yeah, of she it. didn't know it was coming, but boy, did she give us. It was and a she looked like she I made. told her what to wear. But we don't want to say. <laughs> yes. She looked beautiful. Yes, she looked so good. Well, one we thing don't that get I all the highlights in one day. Go ahead. Uh, one thing that I want the viewers to know is on, that I thought that I was leaving with three numbers, and I did. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that I was leaving with a bunch of numbers, baby. They came suited and booted with their husbands and wives, <laughs> with their significant others, and with their lovers. Baby, they came suited and booted. No numbers here. Hey, my guy is here. You know, guys, we are running a little late already. So, Katie, can you hit that comedy thing? Because the great Howie Bell is here. <laughs> How we was at the wedding, yo. <laughs> and I mean how we turned it out. Oh, Do you see yeah. it? You want me to help you? I I, I think Let I got help. it. You think you got it? Don't hit that thing. You want oh, to go pow and then all of a sudden I don't the people it. start doing it their like thing. You don't get it where I got it. Bam, right, folks. It's time for Michael Callier's Comedy Corner. Come on, somebody. Some of the funniest comedians on the planet has been on this show. Over 400 comics have done their dance right here at the Comedy Corner. It's going to be funny. I tell you right now, if you ain't funny, woo, it's going to be a long walk back to your car. We're going to talk about you. Ooh, we're going to say some terrible stuff. You're going to hate us. So you better be good because it's the Michael Callier Comedy Corner. <laughs> I am not lying when I say that one of the major highlights at this wedding actually at the reception. Several people got up and blew us away. Eric Roberson uh. got up and sang a song off the top of his head about what just went down in the wedding and the reception and our love. You know, Bird from Judge Judy got up and did imp impersonation. But this guy, Howie Bell got up and did about 10 minutes of comedy and shut it all down. Get your hands together for the great comedian out of Detroit, Mr. Howie Bell. Hey, 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 what's going on? What's happening with it? Good morning. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm on Detroit time. I'm still a little, a, a little early. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hey, Mama, will you jump off and will you call Malika and let her know I do a morning show at this time? Don't be calling me right now. Thank <laughs> you. See you, baby. All right. Hey, man, you turned it out, Howie Bell. First of all, thank you. Oh. You know? Let me just I'm say, let me just say this say real something? quick. I'm going to just say this yeah. real quick. I don't know if you have a connection. Y'all can hear me pretty good? Yeah, but both of y'all are freezing great. so bad that when people are watching it, they're not gonna be able. They're not gonna be able to. It's it's buffing bad. It's buffing bad. Is it really? Wow. Yeah. Okay. Well, I just you can't I be stealing. This, this, you can't can be stealing the Wi-Fi. You gotta use. Your yeah, own. you and Michael are stealing. Yeah. Stay still. Okay. So so. All right. So no matter what, just go ahead because I can see you clearly and I can see me clearly. So some people can see us clearly, but I can't change mine. I'm in the airport, so I ain't got no more Wi-Fi than I right. get. Now, listen, so we're going to make it work. We're going to make this work, and I'm going to tell y'all something. We're going to make it work real quick. And I'm, I'm still in it. I'm back in LA. I'm actually here. No, I'm going to tell you something. 
one of the best weddings I've ever been to. Michael Corey, it was yours. That was absolutely incredible. It was absolutely beautiful. I'm going to tell you something, man. I thought I was getting married. <laughs> I, I, was, <laughs> I mean it was it, it was beautiful I, I mean you couldn't you couldn't ask for a better setting man and to get up there and to be able to make your party laugh and to be able to do that man that was a blessing bro i promise you man i love you to death bro I, man you shut it down brother i appreciate it you were so funny man you got any of it for us today or no <laughs> uh oh you froze again hey Howie Bell, I love you, but we we'll have to let you go because you got that janky Wi-Fi. And got ain't nobody the LA. It ain't my janky Wi-Fi. It's the uh, LAX Wi-Fi. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. <laughs> I'm right here, buddy. You are so right. Don't worry. Well, we'll do it again. Okay, look. We got you. Come back another day this week. Come back another day this week. And I'll be got you. Love you, man. Somewhere. Don't worry about it, brother. I got you. You know, I love you, Howie Bell. And you, man, you laid it out. He laid us out. It was excellent. Oh, I like this best. I always like it best. I'm online, brother. I'm live Sorry, right now, call sir. Your clan. Thank this you. I can say hello. Michael Collier has spent yeah. so much money on his wedding, wedding that the Wi Fi keeps just in and that I gotta take every job I can get. I'm about to go do a job right now in the phone booth because they promised to call. You know, it's oh, I it was quite a surprise to know how much a wedding costs, fellas. If you get married, please marry a woman whose daddy is still alive. <laughs> Let the daddy carry that weight. Now, you can't don't put that on your man, don't do it. And she didn't put it on me. I was happy to do it. This is the best money I ever spent was this wedding. It was, I mean, when I say perfect in every way, you viewers are going to see that for yourselves because we're going to release it in less than 30 days, the one hour of the wedding of the lifetime, the wedding of the century. Okay, wait a minute. Let me do this real quick. Don't go nowhere, y'all. Everybody stay where you at. I'm going to bring up, I want to bring on this, uh, the Syria, can you say her name? The lady with the actress. Dorcia. Wait, no, Elaine is here, right? Yes. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Elaine is one second. Is she here? Yes. Let's go to Elaine. Hey, babe. Hey, everybody. M we gotta go to Earl sports Mace talk well. with Miss Earl. Made it. Yeah. Yay. Oh, I cannot believe my battery is low. All right, please. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, get them, get them on it. Let's hear this sports people. Okay. Let's see what went down. Oh wait, wow. Oh wow. Look at that. Anything. Oh wow! Look at that! Look at oh, that! Oh, oh my goodness! I love your hair! Wow! One, I was so depressed with college football, my hair turned blue. Oh wow! Then I went into a witness protection plan. It's working. I can't. I can't recognize it. It's working really well for you. You look say. so good. I, I see what you're doing with that blue. It looks fantastic. And and uh, thank you, thank you for coming this morning to do the sports. I know y'all probably want to come because you heard Chicago finally won a game. So we won <laughs> Thursday. Yeah, you, you beat the Panthers. Game. Yeah, you, yeah, you, you of course did. Of it was you against did. the Panthers. <laughs> yes, who's Who on the one one game? Panthers. Yes, they only won one game. So they Chicago. Yeah, but you know who won. else won la yesterday? Who? who upset was who? um Arizona Cardinals. They're now two. Oh, they have they two wins one. now. They upset the. Uh, Atlanta Falcons. Yeah, but the so Falcons are what, terrible. What was the most exciting game, though? Of, of Niners the, and Raiders. Did the Raiders, the Raiders did great. My my Raiders won last night. Oh. Yep, yep. Oh. They beat the New York. They, they they beat the Jets last night. Great game, man. It was unbelievable. And oh. the fact that Cleveland upset the Ravens at home. That was a big win right there. And San Francisco what? beat Jacksonville, too. That's That was a big win, too, that for the 49ers. I mean, not just beat them. They killed them. Yeah, beat them down. Beat them down. Hey, well, hey, I hey. have a confession, too. Okay. I had to pay $25 to that for damn old and Polynesian because he won. What, what was the <laughs> game that he that he, he to me? I bet him against Miss Elaine. And he, he, I mean, the moment the game was over, he texted me. He said, here's my Zell. So you know what it's sitting at $25. <laughs> I'm like, oh, Lord. 
What game was it? Do you know? Yeah, it was against the Raiders. That yeah, I can't um, remember you do. Yeah. That uh, uh 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 the Detroit Lions won. Okay. Detroit Lions. Yeah. Won. Detroit. Yeah. Oh my God. Tonight's well, Broncos. Tonight's Broncos and Bills. I'm taking the Bills. I mean, yeah, he's Broncos. Win. Yeah. The Broncos are terrible. The Bills are winning out. The Bills, the Bills are winning out. But hey, hey, Lane, you heard about uh, Texas A and M fired uh, Jimbo Fisher, and now they're looking to go out to Dion to come to Texas A and M next year. Have you heard that yet? Yeah, but Dion, Dion, what happened to them? They had the game. They should have won. Yeah, they should be Arizona because they was up pretty well and let I Arizona win that game. Yeah, yeah, I know. Are there no defensive coordinators out there? Dion, <laughs> Dion, he's firing coaches in the middle of the season. He's just trying to get it together, man. We'll have to see did, what happens. Did you did you hear Texas A and M just canceled their coach, their head coach? They oh said, yeah, Jimbo Fisher. Yeah, yeah. we, we can right. play better with no coach. <laughs> that's why what I said. You mean they canceled them? No, so they don't have a coach at all. No, they fired the head coach Michael, and now that, there's a rumor that's out there now saying they're going out to Dion Sanders to come to Texas A and M now. Yeah. That's that's the rumor right now. Well, so Dion, so no matter what you say about Dion, Dion is one hot potato. Oh yeah, of course they want him because just they, they fired the head coach Jimbo Fisher, and they're gonna pay him seventy-seven million dollars even though they fired him. Seventy-seven million they owe him. Mm. That's crazy. Dang. It's, it's crazy because somebody would fire me and just go ahead. And, and, well, it's just that. College football this year is so bizarre. And the teams that they've moved around, like yeah. Ohio State, Michigan, Har they don't have a coach. Harbaugh's banned. What did he do that was so awful? Well, he did a lot. They had to organize uh, cheating. He was watching other, other teams steal their signals and their calls. He did a lot. You can't do that. It was organized, too, by the way. Oh, don't okay. mind me. I'm looking for a plug. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I think. Hey, hey, hey Lane, I, I saw the USC play. game this weekend. Your, your Trojans. What Did happened? they play? They, I thought they played Oregon, didn't they? they canceled it. This Saturday, the Loser Bowl. UCLA <laughs> and SC are playing. It's the Loser Bowl. <laughs> Can you believe both of them? I mean, oh, the fact yeah. that Arizona is ranked is yes, shocking. I know. They're pretty good, though. They're pretty good. Arizona's pretty good. Although I thought Dion had an opportunity to beat them this weekend. They, they should have. There good. was they no should've. reason yeah. for them not to. None. Yeah, 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 None. Yeah, yeah. But the thing in the NFL with Philadelphia being 8-1, and one, I still they're very good, but I don't think they're the best team. I think the best team is, is, is the San Francisco. I'm still saying that. You I think still think with the 49ers? The 49ers no looking what. pretty good, no matter what, because they had some mm -hmm. guys that were hurt that came back this weekend. Trent Williams, of course, uh, Debo, they, they they played pretty well. They beat Jacksonville. They beat them down pretty bad. Oh, 34-3? Yeah. to three. Yeah. Well, guys, we have already run out of time. Okay. We got to go. Any prediction for the week coming up? Oh man, it's just we I mean, have the loser bowl. Let's see, we have the loser bowl, and then there's another loser bowl up north. Um, Stanford and Cal. Yeah, I, it's I think loser this, weekend. That's right. That's right. So we're gonna call so, this the L weekend, the loser weekend, a big L. So we we had plenty of sports. Now, Miss Elaine, can yes. you tell us how was the wedding for you? The wedding was fantastic. It is the best wedding I've told everyone. It was the best wedding I ever went to. But the funniest thing to me is when they say, is there anyone who has any oh, objection to them getting married? That. And he said, keep it to yourself. I love that. <laughs> that was the best part. Bishop was on. Bishop Vance Olds was on. And he built it up, too. He's like, and so... If there's anybody who has any objections at all, keep it to yourself. Oh, it was so good. <laughs> that was hey, Mike, so good. Hey, Michael, I want to say congratulations to you and your new bride, man. I think it's a wonderful thing, man. I'm Thank so you, happy man. for you guys, man. She's so beautiful and more beautiful in person because uh, it was the first time I got too. to see her. Did yeah. she like her gift? 
The dollar like ninety-eight. We like <laughs> all of the gifts. And yes, the dollar ninety-eight was fantastic. People gave us so many wonderful gifts. They've already, uh, and if you haven't had a chance, it ain't too late. Because what I ask people to do instead of giving gifts, if they could, just give us money for the honeymoon fun. And let me tell you, them envelopes came in. We are already set. We are on our way. We're going to definitely have a wonderful honeymoon. Thanks to all the people who gave and came. And it was it's beautiful. We sat on the bed just opening the envelopes and looking at the different wonderful gifts that people gave us. It was pretty good. It was pretty good. Yeah. So I'm gonna But the dollar ninety eight was the best. The dollar ninety eight was the best by yeah. far. Damn right. Congrats, Mike again. Congrats, man. Thank you. So it was you wonderful. Guys. It was yeah. so beautiful. Yeah. I was so proud to be a part in the audience. Yay. Well look, leave us with a woo 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 guys. We gotta go. Woo 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 woo, 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 woo. all day and long right there, the baby. Night. I love you. it. Thank you, right. Reese. Thank you, Elay. Oh man, that's just talking. We talk talk sports. We do that every Monday, y'all. But there is a young actor. Wait, you know, before I go to that, I gotta show one little funny thing that that I enjoy. I I just like it when I just like to laugh. You know, laughter is healing. If you can laugh through a thing, you can get through a thing. And I I was scroll scrolling up and down, you know, just looking for stuff on the internet. And I saw these people cracking an egg on a baby's face. Now, at first you might think, that's a cruel thing. Why would somebody smash an egg? But I laugh. Oh, let, let me show you and you tell me what you think. Okay. Let me crack this egg. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Hey, that wasn't very nice. That wasn't very nice. Can I do it to you? A little bit of salt in it. And then you have to mix it really. What you get? What the fuck? I'm gonna crack one egg. Oh! I'm sorry, but that makes me laugh so hard. Now, next up, this woman is so awesome. Her son's name is Ajani, and Ajani. Sorry about that, call your clan. As we know, our boss spent all his money on his wedding, so his internet is gonna be messed up for <laughs> for a while. But we do have a young lady coming on. And she is the manager, and her son, his name is, her name is Dorcia. Her son's name is Ajani, and he's an actor. And you will definitely recognize this young man as soon as you see him. And Straya, you already know who it is, don't you? <laughs> she dancing. Stay away from them people, kids. All right. You can't get this number either. So thank you, Carly Clan, for being patient with us. We, we had a long week after this wedding. So we're going to get Darcia and her son, and Johnny, up here right away. They look like they ready. Everybody give it up for Darcia and Johnny right here on the Michael Carly Morning Show. Hey, Katie. Good morning. Good, good morning, morning, guys. Darcia Are we pronouncing your name? No. <laughs> it's pronounced Darcia. Thank I'm you. Looking at they want her name to be an old lady name. It's Dorisia. I want to say those public schools. I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I'm an agent, not a manager. <laughs> Correct. That's right, because you have over how many clients? Over over 200, almost 300 now. So, yeah. Oh, wow. So, if you want to if you want to tell us a little more about what you guys got going on. First of all, can we let um Ajani introduce herself? Yeah. What's good? Good morning. How you all and tell doing? everybody what you play him. They already know. <laughs> can you scoot oh, over a little bit? Yeah, see. We, he's out of the he's out of camp. Oh yeah, move uh, to the right. Move to your right. Get close to your mama. She love you, boy. 
Yeah, he's always know. close to me. <laughs> and it's a pleasure having you guys on the show. Uh, Michael will be right back again. He's still an internet in the airport. I'm Stray, the other co-host. So it's a pleasure to having both of you guys on our morning show with us. Nice meeting oh, you. Yeah, I'm used to going through all hell. I don't know what's going yeah, on. Yeah, we at O'Hare. We from Chicago. <laughs> so oh, y'all my know. God. Hey, y'all. Go ahead. Keep, keep hey, going. Keep going, Stray. Yeah, so y'all already know about the janky Wi-Fi and everything. Yeah, yeah. Oh, y'all okay, been watching so me get hammered. Okay, I'm going to take <laughs> over, guys. I'm going to jump in. <laughs> All right. So, hey, hey, y'all. Welcome to the show. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How y'all feel? Good. How you doing? Man, I'm outstanding. I'm so blessed to have you on the show. Look at your gorgeous mama. Hey, mama. <laughs> hey, Michael. You, why y'all look like brother and sister? <laughs> Thank you. Mama is so young. So first of all, Ajani, I want to say congratulations to you for both Thank shows you. you're on and the great job you're doing. How old are you? I'm 20 now. I'm going to turn 21 next month. Wow. You killing the game. How long you been acting? Uh, since I was a kid, really. Probably about 11? 10 years now. Yeah. Oh, wow, wow. So it's just natural for you now, huh? Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. And yeah. Mama... Mama, you say you got like 300 clients? Yeah, yep. <laughs> First of all, how can, how can you manage 300 clients? It's, you know what? I feel like, honestly, I feel like I have 300 best friends because they're always calling, texting. Like, I'm not a normal agent. I communicate a lot with my actors. You know, it's like a family. So, <laughs> so I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm grateful for them. We, um, our agency is named after my mother. She was murdered in Maywood, Illinois, Thanksgiving of 2004. So oh, the whole point, it's, yeah, and the whole point of our agency was to amplify her name. So all of my actors, they help us with that. You know, they say her name, they wear clothes with her name, you know. Oh, nice. Um, so it's a, it's a gratifying feeling. You know, I'm very grateful. No I love all my actors. I love you for doing that, for being there for them. Because, you know, it's a lot of us out here struggling and acting. And most of us don't have representation. So we yes. out here on our own trying to figure out what to do and how to get in. And a lot of times it takes you knowing somebody for you to get Absolutely. in, you know? And you, yes. you, have, you have all the talent in the world. But if can't nobody get you through that door, it don't that's, mean anything. That's true. Yep. And just like all my son, he, he does so many auditions. You know, you can do so many auditions before you get a booking. So actors always have doors slammed in their faces. You know, I, I tell them all the time, I admire them because if you can keep going through that, remember what you're passionate about, even when people are telling you no, to me, that's very commendable. So uh, Johnny, what would be, what would be your best role you've ever done so far? I always say my favorite one is, uh, I did a role in Judas and the Black Messiah. The movie uh, about Chairman Fred Hampton, that's my favorite one because of the history behind it. And I really like the scene. You know, it's one of my first real like action scenes I got to do. So that's probably my favorite and best role that I did. And it's and an Oscar winning movie. Yeah, I would encourage everybody to watch that movie. So and what, listen to the soundtrack. I had Joe, I had a little piece of tape and I, I couldn't show from that, I don't think. Did you did the Keisha Cole story, right? Yep, I did. Yep. I, I have a little piece of that right here. I hit it, but it didn't go. Thank you, sir. Right. Oh, it's baby Mary J. Yep. What up, Keisha? <laughs> What's up, Ann? What's up, Lucky? You got something hot for us today? She came with that. Boy, <laughs> you got a real talent. You a star, baby girl. Don't never forget that. Take this for your film. Thanks, y'all. Stay yes. up. So, were there a lot of acting classes? Yeah, and how did you get into where you are? I definitely did a lot of acting classes coming up. I stayed in Atlanta for a little bit, um, and, and that's where my mom really got the agency off the ground. So I, I did a lot of classes and learning out there. The training is very important. <laughs> so what city are y'all in? We're in LA now. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. Oh, okay. oh right. You are in LA. You're in the Lancaster. Yep. yep. Oh, yay. Okay. So, Johnny, what is the part you want to do that you haven't done yet? That's a great question. I want to do something that that's different. Like, I want to do, uh, um, I don't know if you ever seen Hidden Figures. Like, I want to do something where yes. it's like I'm doing something in STEM or, you know, working on something in space, you know, some scientific, something like that. that I've just never done. I would love that. What is your goal? Um, what is your goal, Doricia? What is your goal with your artists? What is the thing you want to do? Are you trying to be the biggest agent on the planet? What, what are you doing? <laughs> what, what's your goal? Well, my goal is for them to see, you know, the highest height of success they can possibly see. So I want them, I want all of my actors to experience being series regulars and leads and, you know, in film. And I also want them to be able to grow into a way where they, they have a space to create because more of us need to be in that space where we're creating. We need to share more of our stories. And most of the uh, artists that I have, they want to create, you know, um, and, you know, with the strike and everything, I always mm -hmm. tell my actors, like, they, they went through so much, you know, and I always tell them, like, it's a blessing that you're in this industry and, you know, you have this job. However, you don't own this, right? So right. if something happens, like a strike, it's like everything is taken away from you and you can't let that happen. So it's important for you to always hone in on your passion so you can always exhibit it no matter what. So that way, if you want to create your own projects, you know, nobody can stop you from doing that. I love that. I love that. So listen, you say your mom is your inspiration. Yeah, for sure. Let me show, let me show them this piece. <laughs> this is it right here. So, um, you know, my mom, she's a really strong lady. Uh, we just had a conversation last night. She was telling me that, you know, she feels like she's a light because when darkness comes, she tends to prosper through it. And uh, that's exactly what she did, you know. I love that. I, I'm, I'm, I'm just blown away about how you inspire him and who you are. You are great. I want, I gotta have meetings with you because I have some bright <laughs> ideas, young lady, and I think we're gonna make some stuff happen. We gotta um, get together, Michael. <laughs> it's, it's, we gotta do that. We gotta do that soon because you're right down the street from me. So we'll make it yeah. happen. And you could bring your folks on the show. I Absolutely. really wish you could bring actors on who could do monologues. Absolutely. Somebody on here do monologues. Do you do monologues, Johnny? Yeah, I definitely do. I, I done did a lot before. I think I got one on. You do. He has a really good monologue on his page. Yeah. Uh, will you come and do one live here? On I will. Show? Yeah, I definitely will. I would love that. Can we do it by next week? Say it one more time. Can we do it by next week? Oh, for sure. Yep. Yeah. I ain't That'd doing that. fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. All right. Tell people how they can find you. And if there's anything coming up, tell us now. All right. Uh, you can find me on all social media, really, on YJB Johnny. AJ A and I. Um, right now the, the most recent shows I've been on is Power Book Force, uh Power Book Four Force. Um help me on. He's on BMF. BMF. Yeah, BMF. He's on a lot of shows. <laughs> I love um, that. I I like that you that busy. Our our company page is YJB Talent. You can follow us on YJB Talent. Mostly all of our some of our actors and some of our family have YJB in their tag. So just follow YJB. And um, yeah, and we love you, what Michael. If, We're a big fan what, of yours. Yeah. We're from Chicago what, like you. We're going to be in O'Hare next month. <laughs> Dealing with oh, that. I love it. And you see him at this airport. I'm stuck and I got 8% uh, battery. But oh I goodness. went offline and came back on and got my Wi-Fi. So I'm clear <laughs> now, right? And I I'm know not, they don't I'm, got enough outlets and nothing. They don't have outlets at <laughs> O'Hare. Ain't no outlet to O'Hare. Yep. They're killing me. I okay, know. I love y'all so Call much. Call us when you get back. I am. Will you guys leave us with a woo woo woo? Woo the thing woo woo. <laughs> woo woo woo. Oh, I love y'all. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Dorisa and Ajani. Hey, y'all. This is Young Power, Young Stars coming up. 
right now. Hey, um, oh, I guess it'd be a great time for me to. Before I go to, to prayer, I got to show this one piece of animation. I'm, I really want to leave Jada and them alone, but they keep on coming up with funny stuff, right? So I to just love Jada, happy birthday to you. Nigga, where is back? Oh my God, is this your birthday? Huh? Huh? You got, you got to Jada, happy birthday to you. Nigga, where's Bay? Oh my God, is this your birthday? Huh? Huh? Is this your birthday? Because you want attention so bad. Like, why do I have to make a wish when you say make a wish? Why do you want to make a wish so bad? Who said I wanted to be close to the candle right now? I could have made my wish an hour later. You don't know when I wanted to make it. It is like so disrespectful. Like, my gosh. Like, you're literally a control freak. Like, you'll make a wish so bad. You'll make a wish? Wanna make a wish? Okay, I wish Tupac was back alive. <sighs> Get out my face. Get out my face. Like, you're being so disrespectful and so rude right now in front of my family. Like, what is wrong with you? You literally just wanna disrespect me like that in front of my family, Will? You literally going to disrespect me like that in front of my family? <laughs> Stop. There's literally something wrong with you. <laughs> like you should literally just try to gaslight me into blowing out my candle. It's my candle. It's not your birthday. Newsflash. Not everybody can be as big as Will. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> and, and all he said was blow out the candle, baby. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, all right. Let me go to prayer. And first I'm gonna pray that the, the phone will go off. Okay, I got five, I got five percent left. Okay. Oh, and we only got six minutes, so we're gonna finish the show too. Okay, let me get to prayer. Um let me tell you something, y'all. We are more blessed than you know. I know I'm more blessed than I know. And I got married and everything has gotten better every single day since I married this amazing person and just meeting her is a blessing but for her and her entire family and all her friends to embrace me like they do that's amazing so it's all about gratitude for me we're going to start with a holy breath hold that and think one thought one positive thought oh i sure wish i was kissing sonia right now now exhale Father God, as we open our hearts, our minds, our souls, our spirits, we invite you to come in and fill us with your love, your peace, your passion, your joy, your wisdom, uh, your sense of kindness, your sense of forgiveness. Man, we have to learn to forgive everybody for everything we, we ever think they've done to us. But most importantly, we got to forgive ourselves for everything we think we've ever done. Oh, Father God, I pray that you bless us today and bless us indeed. I pray that you enlarge our territory greatly. I pray that your hand will be with us and guide us past evil and we will cause no pain. In fact, take that hand, God, and guide us towards more love, more peace, more power, more joy, and more wisdom, but also more laughter. Because if you can laugh through a thing, you can get through a thing. God, you are so great and wonderful and awesome and beautiful that we are grateful beyond words for all that you give us every single solitary day. Bless you, God. Bless you, God, for all that you are and all that you give us. This day is going to be super califragilisticexpialidocious. Then put some stank on it. God, I just say thank you today. And in Jesus' name, we say amen. Amen. Amen, 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 amen. I mean, I say, boom, shakalaka. And in the voice of all of those, the words of those who are uh, the Kalia clan. Woo, 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 woo. Come on, somebody. Now, the question was asked, y'all, did Stevie come and sing at the wedding? No, Stevie didn't make it, but he did something much better. And you're going to see the first part of it starting tomorrow. So every day we're going to break bits and pieces of it and give it to you until we figure it all out. I'm very grateful to you, Katie, and to you, to you Straya, for y'all coming, man. Y'all on your out your own pocket. And y'all came and was full out having fun or two. When, you, when nobody stuck up, when nobody having no airs, y'all was just rolling. Y'all was the family. Y'all was as much family as anybody else. And we just, oh man, I just love, love, love that y'all came. And there's so many of the Kalia clan members came. 
and, and just showed us love and light. So what y'all doing with the rest of y'all day, Katie? I got so much, I got so much going on, y'all. I got so much business, but I do, I did. I, first of all, at the wedding, I came in and they said, oh, you're on the bride side or the groom side. I said, I got to sit in the middle. Cause I'm with, <laughs> <laughs> and while I was there, I did get to perform with, um, on the stage with D Ray Davis. Um, since then I performed last night and, um, the night before with DC young fly. DC young fly. DC, woo -woo. D oh my God. DC and DC just loves Michael. Y'all. He loves Michael so, 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 so much. Samuel Jackson. Where are you? 152 movie titles, 27 billion. And go ahead, I get it. He played too much. No, <laughs> get your boss right. But no, but at the the wedding was great. But the I'm still just head over heels about the wedding. I'm just, it was great. Sonya is so beautiful in person, and I I had the pleasure of meeting Sonya many many times. And I always say she can't get no prettier. And every time I say that, she just going to show herself up. I'm sick of her. She I, I swear it. to God, she just get. I'm like, awesome. like, what else you gonna do? So, Mike, boss, that must mean that you're close about a door because the Wi Fi is working and we can understand everything no, that's coming out of your I got mouth. off. When I got off, I connected the Wi Fi for the airport. So now I have the airport Wi Fi. So now it's all clear and stuff. And we ask you, audience members, please bear with us. You see where I'm at. I'm in the middle of the airport, but we're gonna do our show. Every day, we don't give a damn what happened. If the tower fall down, we showing up and doing this show. So I thank y'all for being troopers. And when man disappeared, y'all kept it going. God bless y'all. Thank I you. I think Michael went and broke an antenna off somebody's car. Yeah. <laughs> and y'all for the call your clan. Y'all know that's the government. But before he get out of here, we need y'all to like and subscribe. We need y'all to tell everybody because today's show is buffered. But the rest of the week will not. Oh yeah, rest of the week I'll be situated. I have, well, I hope I'll be situated. I left my iPad on the plane too, so now I got to go back to United's Lost and Found and see if they can, they can hand me my iPad back. Okay, so it's, it's, for a, you. it's, it's a it's great day. For you. It is waiting for me. Somebody probably slipped a couple of dollars in it. You know, we always look at the most positive way a place or a thing can be. I love y'all both. Uh, ain't no more I can say. I gotta get out of here. I can't sing. I just gotta. We gotta, and sing. gotta have pictures for me and Katie tomorrow because you got everybody else. You better have pictures of us too. Cause I spent too much money on my dress not to be posted up. <laughs> I didn't get no bunch of pictures of y'all, but did y'all get some? Y'all can send me. I yeah. can post. Boom. Yeah. And there it is right there. I love y'all. I got one percent battery so i'm going to plug this up and call my brother so he can pick me up because i'm gonna no bring car. on while you do that while you do that i'm gonna bring on our vocalist for today to say Ooh. oh my god thank god you i got thought she said she marcia. wasn't coming so, so she did come i didn't yeah. know that I'm marcia sorry. baby if i had known that i'd have brought her on by now i had no idea i'm, I'm like okay. what are you doing and she looks beautiful and sound oh my she, god wait, oh, wait a minute she came last night remember um um stevie was supposed to sing a ribbon in the sky she came to the show last night and stood on stage and said baby i'ma sing a ribbon in the sky for stevie to you and sang the whole song acapella in front of my <clears throat> audience in buffalo bring her on without further ado one wonderful vocal let's get your hands together come on y'all all right listen I marcia mac me. wilson uh -huh. but i want to say today is a happy day and i want to declare it to you michael Oh, happy day. Oh, You're happy very, day. honey. Oh, happy day. You got somebody to share your love with. Oh, love when Jesus was. When Jesus was. When Jesus was. When Jesus was. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. I know you're happy. Oh, happy day. He taught, he taught me, me how, how to walk and pray. My Lord, oh, oh. I can pray. You better watch Every these day. Up there, Michael. Your wife is fine now. Listen. So you better get up every morning and rejoice. And say, I got the finest woman today in my bed. Good God, my Lord. Oh, happy day. Yes, Dr. Oh. Baby, this is for you. Oh, happy day. This 
Oh, for you, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. That's for y'all show. I oh, love happy you. Day. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, You're yeah. fantastic. Oh, happy day. Come Let's on, y'all. What are you for? No. That is from a woman who's married 30 years. So as long as you keep God in the middle of that knot, baby, it will come never on. come undone. Because mm -hmm. God is the one that is going to keep you together, Michael and Sonia. And if yes. every day you get up and you declare it, this is a happy day. Happy day. I love you. Yeah. yeah. Come on, y'all. Where is Claus at? Where the Claus? Yeah, baby. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we love you. Thank you, sister. And she brought a vocalist that's going to come on tomorrow. So every day this week we'll have vocals. Every day this week we'll have comedians. And every day after today, I'll be sitting down at the console and it'll be smooth as silk. Thank you, everybody, for today. You know, I had to scramble in this airport, but we made it happen because I got a hell of a team. God bless all of y'all. Have a super califragilisticexpialidocious. Let day let no one steal your rainbow. And remember, life is a garden if you dig it. See y'all later. Bye. Listen. Come on, y'all. We're going to sing off the air. Ain't no mountain. Hey! Woo!